Interesting. Huh. Actually, they're like doing the same thing. Okay. Um. Alright, so let's go ahead and continue our classic mode. We continue. Um. We were doing pretty good last night. So we'll just continue. Uh. The path that we were going. So we did get raided. Uh. We were all armed. Nobody was wounded. Which is good. Um. What's her? So she's sad. He is very hungry. Okay, so let's see if we can go make some food. About her, she's tired. Let's go ahead and have her rest. All right, good, so we can make two meals. We'll do that. Uh, she's hungry and he is tired. So I'm gonna have him rest too. Once he's done playing with her. I'm waiting until she gets very hungry. Uh, let's have her go play down there. It's kind of funny. Only one person at a time can go uh, down the steps, up or down. Have him eat. And then I'm going to have him go uh, rest too. Kid's playing all by herself. Yeah, I want him to be rested up for, uh, actually, let's go up there. Yeah. And then these guys, they'll, they'll probably, uh, stop being tired very shortly here. Still doing pretty good on bandages. Uh, still doing good on everything else. The kid, she's still sad. Let's have her go play it back here. Can we... Crystal, can we upgrade this yet? Let's find out. Oh baby, we can. Advanced workshop. All right, he's not super tired, so that's fine. I have a feeling somebody's gonna be coming to the house soon. I mean, it's not a big deal if they don't. Won't really make a difference for us, at least. Manage to keep it warm. All right, sweet. I hope we manage to keep it warm here. Or that's what he said. I'm gonna check the radio just for the night. We wear bandits. It's pretty cool outside. Wait, what did that say? Advice for a cold evening is grab a good book and a hot cup of tea, relax in your armchair by the fireplace. Beware of bandits. Um, rampage extreme vigilance is advised. Okay. So it's still just just bandits right now. Um nothing too bad. Is there anything new we can make or should make? So, garden, alcohol distiller, here we go. Distills moonshine into pure, high quality alcohol. Component for meds and bandages or a barter, bartering item. Okay. Make a toy box. A swing. Reinforced door. Once we board up holes and windows in the shelter, we can think of reinforcing the door and installing a simple alarm system. I think I'll actually go for that. We only need 10 more components and uh, four more. Uh, wood and electric parts. So we almost got that. No chairs, no guitars. Yeah, I would like to get the reinforced door because I'm sure that would save us a lot. Okay, so electric electric parts is going to be start to be our, our priority. And yeah, we got some heat lamps too. You only need four for these, which is good. I didn't realize how cheap that was going to be. 
about to upgrade this. Okay, same thing. Electric parts, wood, and components. That's our priorities. Um, to upgrade this, I would like to get that thermoregulator. Because that'll make this room be a lot better. I mean, it's not really too bad just yet, temperature-wise. Heat rises, so technically, does that mean that it's going to... Is it the same uh, temperature everywhere? It looks like it might be. Okay, let's have... I wish you could make the, the characters talk to each other. Okay, so she's all set. Kid... She's sad. Let's have her play. I want to have Krista relax for the rest of the night. Um, I think we're good on food still. Fertilizer, that's fine. Uh, do we have some... Okay, rainwater. We need a... Fuel. Nice, so Christo's all rested, so is Roman. Very good. Let's make one filter. I want to make sure we still have this, uh, plenty of water going. that wait he just gave her food what i did not approve this unless if it was just like free food that he gave her is there a chance for dessert kid what oh snap <laughs> oh god Uh, yo, what's going on, Dragon Bloggers? Thank you very much for the raid. Welcome, welcome, people. Hey, man, thank you for the 20 bits. Yeah, I appreciate that, Dragon. How you doing tonight? What were you playing? How is your stream? What is going, get even? What is going on, get even? How you doing? How you doing, buddy? I'm doing pretty good, man. What's new with you? I am just uh, trying to get by in the war here. Good, a new horror game called The Coma 2 Vicious Sisters. Oh god, I was just walking, watching some creepy game. That sounds fun and terrifying, but that's cool. How'd that go? Was it uh, as scary as you thought it was going to be? Is it like a first person type of game or just like a top down? Honestly, don't think I've heard of it. Just intense. Or just tense. Yeah, Jackie, my streamer, had a few scares. <laughs> no, it's part of visual novel. Just part of venture. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. That's cool. I hope that was a... It sounds like it was a good time. Uh, let's have these guys go on guard. And Christo here. Side scroller, visual novel, hybrid. Okay. Gotcha. That's pretty cool. I'm glad I... Uh, Glad you enjoyed it. Uh, I'm currently playing technically my second playthrough of this game because I failed after like uh, 17 days in game time and uh, now I'm trying to make up for that. So it's it's been interesting so far. Ah oh, crap, didn't mean to. Uh, the church has been, we can spec rubble from our men are said to occupy the building now. Going there might be dangerous. You know what? Let's try it. I've never been to this place, but it says possibly danger. Um, but I want to see what stuff we can gather before entering the building there. Okay. As a child, I'll come here with my parents. 
Do you guys know about this war of mine? Or heard anything of it before? I'm just curious. So I go live on Twitchkin streaming this game. Okay, nice. I, well, I appreciate the raid, man. Thank you very much. That's it. That is how I chose to raid you tonight. Haven't heard of it. Never played. So it's essentially, as you can see, it's, um, I guess, I don't know what is this considered side scroller. I'm not sure, <laughs> but, uh, it's basically like a management game. You play as civilians in, um, in like, I don't know what year it's supposed to be. I think it's sp supposed to resemble like the, I don't know if it's the real name or the fake name, but some by Snogian or something like that. War, and you play as the uh, the civilians during that time. So it, it can be very, uh, it's known for being very like emotional and stuff because you have to make hard choices. Like you choose whether you steal from people or not, whether you're gonna help people or not. Um, things like that so but it's basically an RPG too um, just just checking it out on the web I'm tired of rating dead by daylight <laughs> I got you I, that's one of those games that I've gotten into a few times but I can never fully stay into it I don't know if these guys are hostile or not but I'm trying to stay out of uh, sight for them Let's see so right now my uh, the family members that I have are the people in our group are currently at our base and as they're resting sleeping uh, guarding the home I'm out here scavenging trying to get parts and materials to bring back so I'm gonna drop that uh, see games typically last uh, for about uh, I think it's 20 to 50 days so the goal is to try to survive the war gotta run my wife wants to finally watch Picard episode 4 now have a great stream hey man thank you again dragon I hope you have a good night and uh, enjoy the uh, show is it like a survival game yeah it, it literally is a survival game um, there's a ton of characters too, different like different endings, random events. Um, you might have somebody come to your door asking for help. You might have somebody coming to to your door like during the day looking to trade. It all depends on uh, the random scenarios. My first playthrough, the people that I played with, I was just learning, so I didn't really know much. We only made it 17 days until. The one guy got injured really bad. He ended up dying. And then the two other people became very depressed. And then I didn't really have anything for them. They were too tired, so I couldn't take them out scavenging the next night. Next thing you know, the next day, they're both broken down. And when they're broken down, they won't move at all. Like, they're, they're literally broken. So, uh, it was interesting. Ah, uh, so uh, that didn't go well, but a at a well cap K at well at at we like a pike. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm butchering your name so bad, but thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. All right. I don't know where this dude with the gun went, but I'm going to try to. Uh, scavenge just a little bit more. We're kind of running out of space here. Nice. All right, got that. I can't get through that, which sucks. But there's a mark on the wall. A few words. Here lies Roxy, the best dog in the world. <laughs> Not the dog. Uh oh. What? Uh oh. Run. 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 Hey man, I was just here to trade. I'm going. Oh man. 
technically this wasn't stealing. All right, it's exactly 3 a.m. and we're running still. Sweet. We made it out alive. Now let's see how our uh, our base did for the night. Day 18. It looks like it was a quiet night. Yes. All right. Good. Very good. So he's very hungry right now. He's hungry and tired. Let's have him go rest. She is very hungry. She just, the kid just ran all the way to the other side. <laughs> Could eat anything. All right. Let's have him have this meal. Can we have her pick up the food down here? Nice. We can make two meals. Here. Oh man. We're not going to have enough for vegetables anymore. But that's alright. We can still at least make one meal, which is good. Okay. Let's have her have one meal because she's she is very hungry right now i'm gonna have him rest uh she's hungry but she's not very hungry so that's fine soldiers stopped everyone from coming into the city so i asked my friend who had some toy soldiers to help me stop the rat from coming into our basement he agreed and we put them on a guard in front of the rat hole but when night came the rat just trampled on them placed soldiers behind a barricade and made of bricks and rubble Oh my god, that actually scared me. <laughs> Yo, get it, you've been thanking for the follow. I appreciate you coming through tonight as well. Staying in and chatting with me very much. Okay, let's have her go. If she can go talk with him, why not? Uh, She's... Okay, so she is tired. But that's okay for now. Just me, I love the siren while playing a survival game. <laughs> it was perfect timing. <laughs> um, let's see. So you've been keeping the room nice and cool. Here's a trader. Uh, let's see what he's got. This game is very cheap right now too. I think it's like, uh, it's like two dollars on a uh, humble bundle and then it's like three dollars for the most recent expansion and one dollar for the uh the children expansion so it comes out to a total of like eight dollars on humble bundle um just if you guys wanted to pick it up or not or if anybody is interested in it i had it through ea origin um and it was the anniversary edition but after playing even like uh, one night of it i realized i wanted to see how much it would be for the most updated version and uh that's when i found how cheap it was so it's definitely worth it in my opinion for that price i mean pretty worth it <laughs> i would say all right, so I'm going to try to get some of these. Um, you can sell the tobacco to them. Usually, okay, we don't need the books. Take components too. All right, now let's see what we can trade to him for this. Try harder. That's fine. Uh, how about some coffee? Yes. All right. Let's take some more components from him. And actually, we'll take some parts too. It's quite common. Oh, whoops. I don't want the sugar. That right now, at least. All right. If we can get the rest of these off of him and 
uh, those vegetables, then we'll be pretty much set. Yeah, we'll use cigarettes too. Okay. How about some moonshine? Two moonshines. Uh, some fuel. Um, uh, maybe we don't need all that much. Okay. Let me just pull this. How about for that vegetable? And this smooth shine. Hmm. All right, that's. I feel like eh, that's that's fair. I guess. Does the vegetable really cost that much? All right, that works for me. Um, let's go have her go down there. And I think that's it for tonight. There we go. All right, so we'll have her guard again. Same thing with him. They can sleep and I will go out and scavenge some more. Um, shoot, I should have checked the daily, uh, this, uh, the, the radio. Hey, get even. Thank you for the host there. Appreciate that. Hotel. I haven't been to the hotel yet. Kind of nervous about it too. Lots of food, lots of meds, huge amounts of weapons, lots of parts. Caution advised. Danger. This place is just straight up danger. Might find useful things there. We can sneak in, but it's very dangerous. Possible trade and danger. Caution advised. Lots of food, lots of meds, lots of weapons, a huge amount of parts. Um, we'll go here and just see what there is. I haven't been there at all. Actually, got nothing to look for there unless we're willing to steal. We can go back to the supermarket. Good luck seeing you next time. I I have to go, so I'm hosting. All right, man. I appreciate you stopping by. Thank you for the follow, and uh, have a good night. Thanks again. Um, City Hospital. I mean, we, we did make a pretty good run there last time. I'm just afraid there's not much left unless we went out of our way and started stealing. Um, Shoot, I keep moving my mouse off screen. All right, let's try going to this small apartment. Imagining they'll probably have supplies like food and meds, but they won't be willing to share. We can try to steal or take them by force. I don't want to steal, but I'm going to try to uh, just pick up some stuff, I guess. Let's take a crowbar. Normally there's like a good area that you can search before actually getting to the house. I should have brought a shovel, man. Actually, look inside. Something's going on up there. Can I get down down there? Is there a way in right here? There is, but shoot. So I think a certain area here. Oh God. Uh oh. He's reading a book right there.
All right, let's not spend too much time here. I'm honestly just grabbing whatever I can. And vegetables. Oh, yes. All right, let's get out of here. Pisto is back. Yo, we just made out with that. But I... I don't know if that's considered stealing. Because it was all... Uh-oh. We got raided at night. They came in by force. Thankfully, we were armed. Nobody was wounded. We all returned. Alright, good. Let's talk to the kid because she's sad. She's hungry and tired. He is very hungry. All right, you can go eat something, my guy. Some coffee is once again available. That it remains on expensive commodity, but its price is no longer border and extortion. Overcast. Uh, it's getting colder every day. Make sure you have enough firewood and central heating is available where you live. Okay. Uh, let's try to up to upgrade this. All right, we need the thermostat. Okay, so how many? We can make the thermostat. That's fine. I would like to get some more electrical parts, though. It's talking and tired. She's hungry. I'm make sure they're all well rested. We got plenty of food right now, too, which is nice. Okay. I want to see if we can make food, just in case. If we need it. Okay. We are good, but we'll need some more water eventually. So I'm going to have her make a filter real quick. Make two, actually. And you can go down here. See if we can upgrade this. Or actually, this guy. Nice. Someone's at the door. Uh-oh, it's a bunch of kids. Uh, Roman, go answer the door. Oh, no. We can't turn our back on some kids, but holy crap, dude. They're going to take up some, so much. Our mom is sick. Please help us. Oh, whoops. What did you need? Uh, we live several blocks away from here. Our mom is very ill. She needs medications. Could you spare us any? Without her help, she will die. Um, after Danny went to fight, we only have her, please let, yeah, we have plenty of meds. Let me see who it is. She always wants to know who it is. Alright, you can go lay down again. What's he say? Poor children, I hope their meds are enough to help their mother. Some kids came to visit us. We gave them some pills for their mom. I wonder if they can play with them next time they come. Meds are hard to come by, but we did the right thing. All right, that's good. You couldn't just leave those poor kids without help. That would be callous. All right, that's good. Content? Why is he content? Is that good? She's hungry and tired. Or actually, let's have her... Do we fill this up? Okay, now we did. 
we do need meds. But right now, I think we're doing okay. How much is it to upgrade this? We'll do better on fuel if we can. Uh, if we get about 10 more components. Or no, 6. 6 more components will let us upgrade that. Um, how about this? Oof, I need a lot of components. So components is our big thing that we need right now. Um, practically everything else will come by itself. If possible, I would like to get that upgraded. Okay, let's go check out this. So this is where we make um, bandages, but we still have plenty of them. Plus we have the uh, um, the shop if we ever actually get wounded. Herbs can be used to make herbal medications. Um, Think we listened to this thing for today already? Yeah, we did. Alright, I'm just gonna end the day. Okay, sleep, guard. Guard and scavenge. Uh, is there any new places? Nothing. Danger, some parts. Danger, possible trade. I think it was the... Which one has huge amounts of materials? We didn't visit the brothel. Thought we did. Lots of food, some materials, some meds. The huge amounts of materials. Lot of stuff to barter, even food and meds. Let's remember to take something if we want to trade and pay them a visit. I can't remember if this is the one that has a ton of. Uh... Damn, we haven't been to Bandage Cottage in so long. The people still live here. Uh, brothel. Huge amount of materials. All right, yeah. I don't know if... Oh, yeah, we'll bring the crowbar. It's my first time in a place like this. Yeah, it's not... It doesn't even start until all the way over there. A wood... I mean, we'll take it, but I would prefer to have uh, materials. Okay, we need to bring one of those from now on. Uh, sparing thought to Danger Zipper, a tiny frame, whoever tossed it here wasn't their owner. See, that's what I like about these places, is they, they always have a lot of materials before you actually go inside. Let's open this up. Will he actually use... Okay, so we won't even use the crowbar. Okay. Let's go up there. Uh Oh, whoops. Nope. Oh. I thought he could climb up right there. I think that's the entrance into this place. And there's some more materials up there too. Oh, wait. 
There's something right here. Components, components. Where art thou, components? Uh, let's drop this. I don't say wish you could carry more, carry more wood, but you can only carry two. It's kind of, it's, I don't know. It's weird, in my opinion. I guess, I mean, it's re not realistic, <laughs> but I don't know. It would just be com convenient or more convenient. Uh, we need electrical parts if we can find some. I need to start bringing the saw blade. Will they give me trouble? Uh oh. Hey man. Are you willing to trade? He is willing to trade. He has a broken shotgun. That would be good to have. It would cost you dot dot dot. I hope you change your mind. Yeah, see, that would be breaking in. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna try to see if I can get inside here. Because typically, they're usually not picky if you can take stuff from here. Nice. Okay, there's some electrical parts. Let's take that too. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I don't know if somebody's coming this way. Okay, maybe not. I think these open areas they might not come to. Let's just look. Okay. There's a ton of stuff right there. Alright, that's fine. I think we're pretty much set on stuff anyways. Let me just check this. Oh. I didn't realize I didn't check this. I mean, I wish we had some more electrical parts, but that's okay. Said I hear something. Me too, man. Me too. It's just the rain. We made a stand. Day 20. Ah. Found plenty of stuff. What a night. Night was clean. It seems that Roman is starting to feel a bit unwell. Uh-oh. Roman. Slightly sick. Alright, go rest, my guy. He's very hungry. She's very hungry, too. Alright, let's, uh... Actually, can we upgrade this? Yeah. Can. Um, yeah, let's upgrade it. That way we can be a little bit more fuel efficient. I'm gonna look something up too. So when should you start heating the house? Uh, this war of mine heat heater. Uh, temperature to guarantee survival won't become... Survivors won't become sick as 15 Celsius since the therm smo eh. thermometer changes its color from a deep red to a blurred red at 14. This means that players should let the temperature go above 15 by at least 2 to 3 before 8 p.m. As there are 2 to 3 temperature drop at nightfall. Um, what's that mean in Fahrenheit? <laughs> It says, um, 
so it's useful during winter to keep the shelter warm and prevent su survivors from being sick or freezing to death. Uh, winter starts immediately. It can be located in the basement. Wait. Simple heater is often provided for free during game runs or winter is immediately starts. Okay, I see. Roof heater can maintain higher, however considerable investment must be made. Need to craft a regulator from those. Okay, so that's what we made. Can store at most six fuel. The more fuel it stores, the more it increases the temperature inside the shelter. Fuel seem to burn slower in an improved heater. If you're having a hard time staying warm in the winter, try building an additional heater. Two heaters with a full six will make, take a toll on your resources, but will guarantee the max temperature of 24. So, heating tips, let me just check this. Heater works best at max six. Heater works be well in a basement. Beds slash chairs should be placed near heater. Uh, ending the day early can leave the heater low on fuel overnight. Uh, two heaters increase the temperature at the cost of double fuel costs. Uh, okay. Yeah, it's about the same thing that we just read. Heater Fahrenheit. <laughs> Is that going to be an answer? Get used to that global standard Fahrenheit makes no sense at all. <laughs> all right, fine. We'll we'll learn. Uh... Oh wow! So it is pretty cold right now. <laughs> Forty-four. I'm thinking. Okay, yeah, that's kind of cold. All right, so let's put some resources down here, and then I see why he got he got a uh, cold or got sick. All right, did she make the food? All right. Nice, and we have plenty of uh, stocked up other stuff too. He's very hungry as well, but have him go eat. She's very hungry too. I'll see if I can uh, make the other thing. What temperatures did it say? So right now we're at seven. Fahrenheit. I can't even spell Fahrenheit. Fair. Fahrenheit versus Celsius. Thirty-seven degrees Celsius is the equivalent to ninety-eight degrees or normal body temperature. Fever and Celsius temperature is greater than thirty-eight degrees or equivalent to one hundred and four. Okay. Coincide at negative forty. So is negative forty the same as zero? Or okay, so zero. Celsius is freezing. 32. 10 is 50. 20 is 65. 30 is 85. 40 is 104. Okay. Got it. Got it. Average room temperature. So an average room is 20, 20 Celsius and 68 Fahrenheit. Hey, look at that. I'm learning something. <laughs> so 68 and 20 are about the same so 30 is 86 I like I like my weather at like 25 celsius probably that's probably about it is 25 would be like 75 76 maybe something like that like that 
30 is 86. Maybe even like 28 Celsius is like my preferred weather. Like 80 degrees is like perfect. I think. Okay. Damn. So when it's like 14 degrees out, it's negative 10 Celsius. Huh. Got it. Okay, so and the max it can go to is 23. Let me just check one more time. We still hear the war. But we tapped out. Temperature won't become sick as at 15. Oh. So we have to keep it at 15. Is its color from okay? Whoa. Well, we are half of that right now. Since the thermometer changed its color from deep to blurred red at 14, this means that players should keep the temperature, uh, should let the temperature go above 15 by at least 2 to 3 before 8 p.m. Hmm. Oh boy. Well, we better uh, stock this thing up then. I don't know if she knows how to put stuff in there. But she does. Good. Good job, kid. Let's put three in, see what that takes us to. And how much can we make now? We're out of six. Uh, let's make two more meals and she can have one. Okay, so we might need to put one more in there. She can go barter with him. 16, 17. All right, good. Good. Okay, you can kind of tell too. Um, electrical parts. Got any of them? Franco? Franco, buddy -o. Um, hmm. Doesn't really have any. He does have some vegetables, though. So. I'll take the wood. As usual. And some components. Now, what do you want? How about that? How about that? Actually, I'll keep them, just in case. I'm a little bit nervous. Nothing special, but not bad either. How about that? And, um, some weapons parts. Actually, I feel like I might use that. I need to keep the fuel and the weapons. How about some fertilizer? I don't know about that. I'll take, I'll keep my fertilizer. I'll just get rid of some of these. All right, there. Fair enough. I have something to eat. Yeah, kid. Says I should sleep off last night. Yeah, go ahead and go rest, my guy. All right, Roman is recovering, so that's good. We're at 20, 23 Celsius, or 22. The max it can go to is 23, so we're doing pretty good right now. I mean, we could make one more. Um, let's see if we can actually make one more heater and maybe put it in this room somewhere. We could. But I'm nervous about the whole... How much it would cost. Alright, let's use that fertilizer for that. And she's tired, so we'll go have a rest. Kid, you can go play. Okay, so it is burning kind of fast. It's going down to 21 already. It's 
so four keeps it at about 21. We'll see what it goes to by like seven o'clock. And that's what we will know we'll keep it at. Um, my guess is like two or three. Right, let's listen to this. The defense guard patrols have put an end to the wave of crimes. Course is over, but it doesn't hurt to remain vigilant. Thanks to some humanitarian aid. Classical music plays. Overcast the entire. It's getting colder every day. Make sure you have enough firewood. If central heating is unavailable, where you live. Alright, so we're at 21 right now. Still getting by pretty good. I'd gladly eat something. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. <laughs> Catch a tiger by the two. If he hollers, let him go. Daddy! Daddy! Who makes all the bombs? Are they people? Oh, God. They are people. Yes, other people make them. I want to see what his responses to that. But they're not like us, are they? Nope. <laughs> Alright, so it's at 20. We should be good. Okay, it dropped to 19. Not bad. Let's have him guard. Um, we'll go scavenge. And we'll have him sleep so that way he can rest. We should be good. Honestly. But I'm just nervous. Got nothing to look for there unless we're willing to steal. Huge amount of weapons. Danger. Hotel. Warehouse. Find some things there. If we sneak in, but it's very dangerous. Um, One of these had a ton of parts left over. It might be the... Or materials. Yeah. Ruined villa. Desperate. We could try to trade from them. Warehouse. But that's very dangerous. Alright, let's get to Ruin Villa. Actually, shoot, I keep forgetting to make one of those saw things. But yeah, let's go here. I'm gonna bring the uh, crowbar just in case. So, nobody should get sick for tonight, which is good. Oh god. Oh god. What? Oh, sorry. Oh god. Oh no. Don't go easy on him. Oh no, I can't scavenge during combat. No, 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 run, 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 run. Run! 
I don't want to fight. I didn't know they would get that hostile. Holy crap. Oh god. Alright, next time. Diary, first blood. Bio. Despite my, my daughter's fears, I decided that staying in the basement was safer than not. I thought it was his temporary arm. Didn't expect the siege to last very long, but it turned out we spent many months there. Everyone from our ten tenement shared whatever we, we had with each other. He's very hungry. Alright, let's have him go eat. She's hungry. She's hungry and tired. Roman's going to eat something. Have him go downstairs. Okay. Peter's at 13. Uh, let's put one. Two more things actually in here would probably help. Yeah, there we go. Uh oh. We need wood or books. Uh oh. Make two of these. All right, so wood is going to be our way to our way to survival now. Components. How do you upgrade it? Okay, yeah, we don't really need to worry about that right now. Not right this second, at least. Uh, can we make any more food? Just in case. Okay, we cannot, and we need more fuel. Alright, let me put one thing in here, and then, oh, whoops. I finished that up. Then we'll have him run downstairs. Oh no. If we're at 18 right now, that's not really good. Day 21. Okay. Whew. All right, so we have a good amount. We just need to use this stuff to, to make more fuel, that's all. Alright. So, it costs four for that. Let's use two of these. Well, let's use two books. And then we'll use some of the wood that we have. Use about six of them. Alright, let's see if she can go talk to the kid. The kid's pretty happy, that's good. Alright, let's have him look at the... The radio. Overcast for the entire southeast. Uh, getting colder every day. Make sure if you have enough fire. Okay. So let's report that the military has been committing acts of violence towards civilians. Uh oh. 